Hi guys, just a very quick one, um, which is why I have no um, webcam video in this one or anything. Um, it's mostly in response to a um, Facebook posting I've seen made by um, Mr. Chris Perillo, um, basically um, bashing on the new um, Skype beta. Now, bear in mind, beta versions are testing versions. The app is still under development, so things can change. Um, anyway, as you can see here, the post was, the new Skype Mac beta UI is gigantic. Um, I think that's an overreaction. It's kind of pretty damn large and compared to the uh, previous version, yeah, the current stable version. Um, they went from bad to worse. Well, starters, I don't think there was anything bad about it in the first place. What was bad about it? It worked fine, for me at least. This is, seriously, on the ass end of ugly. Teetering on unusable. Right. Now, this is not a personal attack on Chris, um, or any such thing, as I say, um... This is an error that a lot of people make. Just because you don't like something, that doesn't mean it's bad. You're entitled to your opinion, but you've got to recognise it as that. An opinion. How this has been saying, this is seriously, on the ass end of ugly, teetering on unusable. I think, personally, I, th I feel this is ugly. You know, and it's, you know, virgin on unusable for me. That's not what, that's not what is, how it's being said. It's being, it's be basically being made as a statement. It is ugly. There's no arguing that. It is ugly. It is virgin on unusable. Now, I'm sorry, and pardon the French here, but that is complete and utter bullshit. And that's why I went onto the uh, screencast to actually show you. I, after seeing that, I thought, well, I'll give it a test, see if it's really that bad. And that's what made me see. The guy is overreacting. Oh, ridiculous amounts. Just sing here. Right? This is me signed on to my Skype. There's my contact list. Yes, the window's a lot larger. A lot larger compared, as I say. But I can navigate my contacts, look. I can find my online and offline contacts easily. I can even change the view to a cover flow style, which shoots a Mac. You know, cover flows all over Mac. So I can what? even navigate them this way via the avatars if I so wish. See? Although I prefer that view, I think it just it's just faster and easier. And here's a sidebar. Sidebars again, very Mac Finder-ish, as I say. Um, they've altered the UI a little bit with this, but if anything, I think it fits in with the um, it fits in with um, the whole OS X style better. And just to prove to you that um, that um, What's it that um, calls and everything that Skype still works perfectly well? I'm going to try and run a test call now and let's see what happens, shall we? Um, now, I'm hoping there's going to be no feedback of such. There might be a bit of echo on the video because um, it's basically going to be picking up the speaker sound back through the mic. As I say, I'm just hoping I don't get feedback here. Well, let's give it a shot anyway. It's ringing. Hello, welcome to Skype call testing service. There we After go. After the beep, please record a message. Afterwards, your message will be played back to you. Well, there we go. You see, we've got through, and now it'll give you 19 min minutes, 19 seconds even, to record the uh, little test message, which is almost up now. Let's see if it plays it back. There we go. You see, we've got through, and now it'll give you 19 min minutes. 19 seconds even, to record the uh, little test message, which is almost up now. Let's see if it plays it back. If you are 
able to hear your own voice, then you have configured Skype correctly. If you hear this message, but not your own voice, then something is wrong with your audio recording settings. Please check your microphone and microphone settings or visit Skype.com for more help. Thank you for using the Skype call testing service. Goodbye. Now, what was wrong with that call? That was perfect quality. Absolutely nothing wrong with it at all. Therefore, is Skype unusable? This new Skype beta unusable? No, it works perfectly. It does its job. So, you know, so you don't like the new UI. Big deal, get over it. If you hate it that much, when it's actually officially released, you'll either stay behind on a previous version or you'll just not use it if it means that much to you. It works, it does its job. You don't like the look of it, get over it. You're not God, what you say isn't law. Just because you don't like the look of it, that doesn't mean it's almost unusable or it's crap. Um, it also, the message, it's not, like I said, it's not a personal attack on Chris Perillo. Um, for those people that are saying, oh, Skype on Mac is crap as well, that has just proved Skype on Mac works perfectly well, just as well as Windows, if not slightly better. And that is with the built-in um, iMac mic as well, not with a headset. And you heard the playback quality, perfect. Um, so I think that's all I've got to say on the matter, really. Um, thank you for listening. This is uh, J100R. I'll see you in the next video.